in this video we'll try to solve more problems in fraction this is a common type of problem where we have two fraction which are equal or equivalent and uh, you, you will find that one number will be missing it may be denominator it may be numerator it may be in the right side or in the left side so here we have uh, one denominator is missing and it is in the right side of the equal sign so what will be the value in this case so to find out this we have to check that because these are equivalent fraction so uh, i can convert i can take this six and from six in the numerator six and the 36 must have a relationship in between these two numbers we have we can find some relationship and if you see then it is uh, very much clear that if i multiply six with six then i will get 36 that means the numerator of the right in the fraction in the right side is having one relationship that is multiplication and and with the numbers six if i multiply the numerator in the left side then i will get 36 that means to get the denominator in the right side we have to multiply 9 with 6 then we'll get the denominator in the right side so 9 into 6 is 54 if i'm not wrong so here we can do this we can write 6 by 9 and 36 and in the box we can write 54 let us try another example so this is the question we need to find out what will come in the blank or in the square box which number will come so that both this fraction will become equivalent fraction or equal fraction so for that we need to find out which number I have to multiply with 6 to get th th uh, 72 and if you see if, and if you know the multiplication table of 12 then you can write it directly that if I multiply 6 with 12 then I will get 72 so if i multiply 6 with 12 the denominator 6 will convert to 72 so same type of operation i have to do with numerator so with 2 also i have to multiply 12 to get the numerator so if i multiply i will get 24 okay so the missing number is 24 so 2 by 6 equal to 24 by 72 let us find out the missing number with some other method so this is another you can save two fractions and these two fractions are equivalent so that is why in the middle it is given equal sign so these two are equivalent fraction or equal fraction so how to find out the missing terms here or the missing number what we can do we can do it like we can cross multiply so if i'm cross multiply that is if I multiply 2 and 18 if I multiply 2 and 18 then what is the number I will get I will get uh, 36 okay so if two fractions are 
equal or equivalent then if i cross multiply means numerator of one fraction if i multiply with denominator of another fraction then whatever value i will get if i multiply the denom numerator of the other fraction and the denominator of the first fraction then i will get the same value that means 6 and this missing 6 and the missing number if i multiply then i must get 36 okay so if i multiply 6 with this missing number i must get 36 so what will be that number with which if i multiply 6 then i will get 36 so definitely that is there will be only uh, the, there is only one number that is the number 6 okay so in this box i will be writing 6 so it will be 6 by 18 so this is how we can find out the missing number uh, in the next video we'll see the addition and subtraction of fraction so please like the video if you understood the concept and keep watching the video so that you can understand the fraction completely thank you very much for watching the video till the end